The next problem. So in the next example, uh, we now have a negative angle. All a negative angle, this guy is telling us, when we graph this in standard form, is now we're going in the negative direction, which is going to be clockwise. But again, but again, we understand that halfway around a circle, it still has a measurement of pi. But now we're talking about in thirds. We're not talking about in sixth. So sometimes the y-axis kind of gets in, in the way of us understanding in thirds. So some, I'm going to erase it here, just so we look at the pi in thirds. We only want to graph an angle that's two of those thirds in the negative direction, which is this way. So that's one third. That's two thirds. Okay. So here's my angle. And again, the reference angle is the distance from the terminal side to the x-axis. How far is the terminal side to the x-axis? Pi, pi over 3. And remember, it's always positive because it's measurement, not di direction. So theta prime equals pi over 3. And that's it. It's as simple as we need to get. Okay.